Much of today's scriptures boils down to verses on the art of welcoming and being good hosts. Now, while this act is often quite challenging, in some ways, it's often quite simple as well. It's simple in the sense that the lines delineating who the host is and who the guest is are very well defined. For example, when we welcome someone into our home or into our place of business, we are the hosts, they are the guests. And of course, when we are being welcomed into someone else's home or place of business, the reverse holds true. Church is arguably the one place where this line gets blurred, but it gets blurred in a beautiful way that actually gives us an opportunity to hone the art of welcoming in a way that perhaps we cannot do anywhere else. Whenever we are in church, and it doesn't matter if it's a home church, a community where we've belonged for years and years and been deeply involved and gotten far into leadership positions, or a place where we're visiting for the first time, no matter what, we are always both the hosts and the guests. Because the church is, paradoxically, both God's house and our house. So we are always the guests of God and the guests of one another. And yet, since we are the stewards and the curators of this house, others are always our guests, even if we are brand new to the community. It gives us an opportunity to really assess where we are as individuals and a community on any given day and realize that there are always ways in which we feel the energy and the joy and the creativity necessary to be excellent hosts, but we also feel the emptiness and the neediness of people who really need to be cared for as guests. Church is a place where we have the opportunity to express all of this at once. And so when we read Jesus' exhortation to welcome one another, especially to welcome the weak, to welcome the children, to welcome the outcasts, let us always remember that no matter where we are in life, when we walk into the church, into God's house, God's community, we are always both the hosts and the guests. This gives us an opportunity to give everything we can and to receive everything we need. <laughs>